What up, everybody? Look at me at HQ. If I can hit it, HQ level 11. And uh, I'm almost uh, got my armor here upgraded. I've got two hours, 22 minutes left. And, uh, you know, I have the tank. Yes, level one. I think I might have actually upgrade upgrade the, um, the tank. Actually, I can't. Darn it. I can only use level one tanks. I need a level nine armory in order to upgrade them, so I can't upgrade them in level 8. Darn it. Well, there goes that plan. Anyways, look at that. Look at my beautiful tanks. And uh, I apologize. I know this the, the, the number on the landing craft isn't actually the level, so it's level 10. Uh, so when I was talking level in my other video, I was referring to the uh, the number of the troop capacity. I was interchanging those um, the level and the troop capacity, so I apologize for that. So we're actually at level 10. If we were going to 16 troop capacity, it would be level 12. Okay, so my bad. Anyways, I have tanks. Yes, five beautiful level one tanks, and uh, we're going to see what they can do. Now, as luck would have it, look who landed, Dr. Terror, his level 20 base. So we're going to try and own Dr. Terror with our tanks. Now, the thing about tanks, actually, and let's go to the uh, description, because they're particularly vulnerable to certain attacking structures, right? With this powerful gun and thick armor, the tank is a real war machine. Due to its weight, each tank needs extra energy to land ashore. Um, cannons, boom cannons, and boom mines deal double da double damage. So, boom cannons, cannons, and boom mines. All right. So, we got to be careful about that. We don't want to. We don't want to have anything dealing double damage on our tanks. Um, and you also got to consider it does take energy to get these guys out. So, the only thing we're really worried about here is this boom cannon that's sitting out here. Um, and, uh, these boom mines that are up here, but we can sort of avoid those. We can take out the cannon. We can actually send, we can send our tanks over here and hopefully eventually get them over here and have a ton of energy. So let's see, but we got to consider that, uh, we have a limited amount of time. All right. So let's try and take out the, uh, boom cannon here if we can. There we go. And then we're going to bring our tanks. Actually, we didn't even have... We could have brought our tanks out already, right? Even right up from the start and then worried about the boom can. So it takes two energy per tank to actually land them on the beach. So you have to consider that. Make sure you're considering that when you're dealing with the uh, your, your tanks, okay? So I'm going to throw out uh, a barrage down here. And I'm also going to throw out some... Or at least uh, a couple of these guys. So we'll get that building. We want to get rid of this um, this rocket. Okay. All right. So there's the rocket gone. Our tanks are going to town. Uh, unfortunately, they're kind of spread out. Um, but we have some MGs here. So I think what I'm going to do is uh, allow them to yeah take out a few more things, and I'm going to put them onto that uh, that mortar right there. All right. Now we do have a lot of energy here, so um, I'm not really going to spend it. You know, I want to take out the mortar, and then we'll go take out that uh, that archer tower or sniper tower, and then that'll be it, okay? And then we'll go after the uh, the HQ. All right, so there's the uh, the mortar gun, and let's get the tanks over onto the sniper tower, and we're just gonna see how far we can go with our tanks, right? We'll go, we'll see how far we can go with our tanks here, and on this uh, Doctor Evil's base of terror. So we're gonna send them back here. And then they should go after those two, uh, the supplies, and then after the HQ. So there's the one supply. And look at how much energy we have. Serious? All right, so there we go. And we can use some extra. Oh, we only have enough for two. Darn it. Come on, guys. Finish it off. Finish it off. Those tanks are pretty epic. But they're not, uh, you know, they're not und indestructible. They're not undefeatable. So you just have to be careful. Again, just look out, looking out mostly for the boom mines, the, the or sorry, the boom cannons, the regular cannons, and the boom mines. You got to keep an eye on that. So let's see how far. Like I said, we'll see how far we can get on Doctor Terror's evil base of evil terrory terrorist. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, Doctor Evil! Yes, I know your stuff is gonna replicate. Whatever. Level twenty-one now. Okay, so let's take a look. We got two things over there. Um. We have the one cannon right here. That cannon's sort of out of range, so we don't have to really, really worry about him. We can take these guys out pretty easily. 
Um, and then just send in our tanks after these guys. I I'm pretty sure the flamethrower doesn't even have range on the tanks, so we'll have to see what happens. All right, so let's attack. We're going to throw our tanks since they're slow. We're going to throw them right here. And then we're going to do... Uh, we'll put down a barrage. And we'll put down one of those. Hopefully the barrage... No, we need another one. And done. All right. So now the tanks are moving on in. Yeah, see, they're, they're totally out of range. And I'm, gonna, I'm going to uh, shock bomb... That sniper tower. The sniper tower. The snipers do do some damage. I know it's a, a low level sniper, but that's okay. Yeah, definitely. The 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 flamethrowers can't touch tanks. Period. Nada. We're gonna give a little assistance here on that uh, MG. And uh, then we got a couple of MGs left, and then uh, just the HQ, right? And that uh, cannon that's up in the top corner is not even going to have any impact whatsoever on our, on our tanks. So we're gonna provide a little assistance there. Throw a couple of, uh, actually only one artillery down on the HQ, and I think we're good. I'm liking the tanks. I really want to uh, to try it with my my army of the heavies. You know, two groups of heavies, um, a group of riflemen, and I'm, I'm not sure if I want to replace... I'm not sure what I want to replace. Maybe a heavy with a tank? A, a boat of heavies with a tank? Or uh, a boat of zookas with a tank? I don't, I'm not sure. I think the heavies. We'll have to see. Or even the riflemen. We're going to have to play around with it and see what we can come up with as far as our preferred um, army configuration now that we have the tanks available. Nice. All right. Terror stage number two complete. Level 21. Dr. Evil Terror. Go home. Now what level are we going to be? 24, right? Yep, 24. All right. Let's cut this out. Do, 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 do. Okay, so we got some boom mines in the way. What do we have for cannons? We don't have any cannons on this side. Uh, that guy's out of range. That guy's out of range. Like, all these guys are out of range. We only have to worry about these two guys. That's it. And we don't uh, We don't even have to worry about that boom mine because uh, we're not going to get that close. We're not going to get close enough, right? So 3,600. I think I'm going to take out the sniper tower. Um... And then route the guys over to this this way to the mortar and then put them on the headquarters. And we just disregard all this other stuff. I like it. Sounds like a plan. So we'll get the tanks going first. And then we're going to throw some artillery down on this guy. So he's done. Beautiful. And then uh, we want to make sure that we direct the tanks up towards that um, mortar. Right? I think they're all going to go... Yeah, they're all going to go there anyway, actually, it looks like. So that's good. So they're going to go after those two buildings, and then um, they should go after the mortar. Or actually that building. Okay, now the mortar. Good job, guys. Excellent. Yes. Take the mortar out. And then they should go without us directing them right to the, uh, the HQ. So we're just going to give them a hand here. There you go. Three artilleries. Now take it out. There. Uh, we don't. Oh, we can put a barrage. Let's put a barrage down there. Nice. So that's pretty easy. That's uh, stage 24. I think with pretty much any army configuration, that's that's one of the easier ones. I don't know why it's why it's level 24. Sorry, it's stage three, level 24. Um, yeah. No, that's uh, sorry, Doctor Terror. You need some more defenses over on that right hand side. Definitely. Oh, there's a rocket launcher back there. I didn't even notice. But it's way out of range, too, so we got to keep an eye out on that. There's actually a, a resource base that's that's on my map that I haven't been able to take back yet. It's got six rocket launchers on it. It's crazy. It is crazy. And I tried attacking it with, uh, with my tanks, but, yeah, it didn't work out so well for me. Anyways, we're almost done here. I want to get some of those dark crystals, man. we got to get some more uh, masterpieces going. I don't have enough of them. There we go. Level 24. Volcano Island. I love that. Look at that volcano. It's pretty epic. Victory. Alright, so we got two of the uh, shards. Alright, what are we going to be? 28? 28. Let's see what he's got in store for us this time. Alright, so the... Yeah, we got a lot going on here, apparently. We got two boom cannons. 
Now, if I bring my tanks up on the right-hand side, there, he's got more defenses on the left. If I bring him up on the right-hand side, I don't have to worry about that boom cannon. I do have to worry about that one. Uh, I don't even really have to worry about the sniper tower, the MG. Uh, it's just that cannon, the two mortars, and the boom cannon that I really have to worry about here, right? Yeah, because these guys are going to be out of range, especially if I'm in the very back of the base. The MG and the sniper tower. So... Let us attack. We'll take out the boom cannon. And then uh, we'll let our tanks take out everything else. Alright? So. Drop those guys down there. So that's done. Gotta make sure we have enough energy to drop our tanks. <laughs> we have a lot of energy because we have that... Uh, I think it's a masterpiece that I get an extra 16% energy on my... Uh, on my troops. Or on, me, on my uh, gunboat. All right, so take that out. I'm going to send them up there. So I'm going to send them away from that MG. We're totally going to avoid that area. All right? And then I'm going to shock bomb the cannon. Which I don't really think it's going to be much of an issue, that cannon. I mean, even doing double damage, it's still going to uh, take a lot to take my, uh, take my guys out. Right? So let's bring them up there. And we're going to drop a shock bomb on the... Uh, the mortars. Again, not really needed because my tanks are not taking a lot of damage here. So there's one mortar gone. And then the second mortar. And then I'm going to bring these guys into the very back of the base. And then hopefully... I, I know because they like to spread out, though. That's the problem. So I'm keeping my shock bombs just in case. I want to make sure... Okay, so they're stationary. And then let's help them out with the artillery. I just wanted to make sure. I didn't know maybe if one creeped back a little bit towards that sniper tower. Uh, if he did, then I would have saved the shock bomb and used it on the sniper tower. But uh, we're fine. So that's uh, Dr. Terror, level 28. Excellent. Party on. Yeah, that uh, boom can is totally out of range. All right. We're done, Dr. Evil Terror. Terror stage 4, level 28. And what do we get? Are we going to get some epic crystals? There. At least we got a, a better one this time. So now, what? Uh, 30 or 32? 31. Okay. And what does he have for us? Alright, so... All these guys are out of range. We've got a rocket launcher and a sniper tower in the back and this cannon. And we have a bunch of boom mines. But we can avoid everything else, right? So we'll take these guys out with our artillery. Um, and then we have to route them around. I don't think we have to take out any of these boom cannons. We can route them around the boom cannons. So I think we're good here as well. So let's uh, oops, do this. Drop three of those right there. Okay, we don't have the sniper tower. I'm going to send them in right now. I know we didn't take out the sniper tower, but that's okay. And hopefully they go towards those supplies over there. I'm hoping they do. Seriously? Tank? Tank? Oh, my God. Okay, whatever. Tank. Be that way. Go after the cannon. And then I'm going to send them in the back. Send them in the back of the base. Back of the base. Back of the base. And we're going to take out the sniper tower. Boom, right there. So that's done. No, 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 don't go over the boom mine, please. Don't go over the boom mine. Oh, wow. Really? Seriously? Oh, my God. Wow. Let's wait. Slow clap for the tank who couldn't go into the back corner and had to go over the boom mine. Seriously? Freaking stupid tank. That's our first casualty of the night. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I can't help it. I mean, it was a good plan. It was We executed it well. It was just that dumb tank. I mean, you know, in hindsight, I could have used another flare just to drew, draw him closer to that side. But come on. That flare was right in that back corner. Oh, he should have He should have gone left instead of just going straight. You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? Anyways, so we're pretty much done here. Um, what else are we talking about here? 
That's it. We just gotta wait for these guys to finish. Unfortunately, with, uh, you know, 20% less force, it's gonna take that much longer to take the, uh, the HQ down. But we got it right here. Yeah. Give me some crystals, baby. The other problem is that uh, it takes quite a long time, a significant amount of time to uh, reinforce a tank. So we're going to be waiting here. I might actually... You know what? Actually, I think we're gone. Yeah, this is like 15 minutes or whatever already. So I think um, what we'll do... Yeah, 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 buddy. Really? They're getting warmed up? Screw you, Dr. Terror. Anyways, so I got to uh, reinforce this. It takes 10,000 and, uh, yeah, 36 minutes to reinforce one tank. That's crazy. Anyways, we'll be back uh, next time. Not sure if we're going to continue with... Uh, we'll probably continue with the Dr. Terror bases, just see if we can get past 35 and um, with our tanks, right? So I hope you guys enjoyed. Level 1 tanks for the win, and we can't get to level 2 until we get to HQ uh, 12. That really... Um, that sucks. I don't like that. Anyways, that's it. Uh, you know what? I'll do the idol first, and then I can do a mass or um, can do the uh, yeah the dark shard statue next time. Okay, we'll catch you later. Spider out.